Hello, Rochester Parkour parents. Charles here bringing you a fun, easy, simple idea that you can do to entertain your kids at home. We're gonna be creating obstacle courses with something that you might have in your closet. This is just a simple roll of masking tape, something that we can put easily in different areas of our house. It's safe to put on certain objects. You can put it on carpet, you can put it on hardwood floor, you can put it on your sofa if you so chose. Maybe not tables but you've got the discretion for your own domain and you can feel free to guide your kids where you want them to go through your own house. The other cool thing with tape is that we can create shapes with them and we can have rule sets that dictate what your kids do on particular sections or shapes of tape. So today we're gonna to talk about a couple different things we can do to get your kids balancing, crawling, jumping, maybe even doing some movements with their hands and their feet, some monkey jumps or other other fun things. Feel free to be creative and add your own as well. For me, I'm gonna create a simple obstacle course just in this one space over here, and we'll come back, show you afterward. Okay, and we're back. So I've, I've created a couple different shapes with this obstacle course. The start can be wherever you want. It could loop in a circuit if you wanted it to, or you can have a dedicated end space if you so chose. Uh, I've got lines to dictate whether or not we're gonna be balancing on two feet. You could also have that be a crawling element. Anything that's a rectangle, I'm considering a jump, something that your kids can jump to, trying to land inside that box with good, proper landing form, they know, as they get their two feet in. I've got triangles here to dictate strides that are jumping out, trying to land with one foot as they stride on out for another one. And then I've got X's as well to dictate that hands have to go there as they travel on through. So for me, if I create this little, if I decide that this is going to be my starting position, I've got two feet on that line as I reach myself out. They can practice their balance as they walk along the line. They get to the end, they've got a box. They can jump to the box. I've got strides, one, two, jump to the line in order to get that precision i'm going to turn i balance my way across and i've got two x's in a box afterward so i'm going to try to place my hands on those x's as i jump with my feet i've got a triangle here so i'm going to tack and i'm back at the start Feel free to play around with the environment that you have. Feel free to make these courses as small or as long as you want. Again, tape is a wonderful, versatile tool and it's semi-permanent. You can just put it down, you can keep it there if you want it to, or you can remove it right afterward and it's like nothing ever happened. Feel free to play around with it. We'll see you next time.